Hello everyone and welcome back to my tutorial and today we will continue to create our building. Actually today I will continue to uh, create some uh, exterior things and we will create interior things uh, such as uh, the rooms and second level. Uh, so today we will prepare our project and to be ready transfer to the lumen. So today it's like a transfer video. Uh, so I think enough talking, let's start. So let's continue. Uh, you already know how to uh, create a kind of uh, kind of walls, and now we will see the more um, complicated situation. Uh, let's say I'll go to the mess and I will create the wall. Um, everything same. Mm, let's interior. Uh, I hope it's interior. Uh, okay, and two hundred millimeters. Yes, it's interior. Uh, as you can see, everything okay everything okay and we get the problem so how we can clean up this problem actually uh so so it's so uh, so easy to clean up this uh, problem uh, we should go to the modify and under modify you will find wall joints let's choose the wall joints and first we will try to fix up this side so let's choose that one and I will change it to miter. And as you can see, everything all right. Let's choose that one. And I will change also to, the, to this one. And that one to this one. And as you can see, we get a really clean uh, geometry in this part. So let's continue the other part in the back side. Uh, I will go again to the manage. Oh, sorry, manage messing uh, wall. And I'll create here the walls. And as you can see, we get uh, two problems here in this side and this side. So let's clean up it uh, again to the modify uh, wall joints, choose that and miter. And this file, this thing same. And as you can see, we get a really nice, a really nice geometry now. Uh, for uh, the roof, uh, in this case, uh, I highly recommend you use the mm, roof uh, because if we will try to make here the wall we will get here the problem uh, under under this one between this and this side so uh, and that's why I'm highly recommend you here use the wall roof let's find the roof I need the roof 200 millimeters I don't have here the 200 millimeters and I'll create it duplicate and let's make it 200 millimeter oh 200 yeah 200 generic roof 200 millimeters doesn't matter about the color because color we will change in uh, lumen so let's choose them and the back side too everything okay i forgot that one and let's create the roof and as you see everything all right but i forgot the one thing that my roof is uh going the inside so i know when it's going to the inside i want to make it outside so let's make 200 off so now everything all right i will choose the my wall and i'll say okay and everything all right as you can see but now you have the question how you can solve this problem because here we have like some solid structure but here not so actually you can uh, solve this problem pretty easy let's use the align and we will use this face uh, to this corner and again i will switch off the my multiply mode this to this corner oh sorry align okay and here the same thing Let's use the uh, top key and join element. And here I will do the same thing too. Okay. So, but still, uh, this is not uh, even uh, looks like that one. Uh, because we should use the join. Let's join it. Now this is uh, one structure. And let's mm, switch the result. And as you can see, we get result as I want. Uh, here I will do the same thing, join, join, and join, and again I need to switch. Let's switch this one, this one, and this one. Okay, so as you can see, we get result uh, pretty close to that one, uh, but only the um, 
color i mean the material here is different okay we can change the material let's go to inside and we'll check here the structure by category right uh, material uh, let's check what type of the material we have inside this roof structure by category same so the, I, this i mean uh, not actually same uh, we don't have any material now just by category but we can choose some material to make it same I will not uh, do that because uh, I will do it in Lumen. So here we will do the same thing. Just use the command align and align roof line to your wall. So like this and like this. And again, just use the join each part join to the roof and switch the order. Okay, we done. I actually we're not done. We we done just uh, this corner. So, but now we will create uh, levels. I mean the floors, and it will be more interesting than this situation. As you already know, if we will go to the messing inside and we will switch off, we will get uh, clear. Uh, our structure uh, anyway we can go to the for example first level and we will see the our building here uh, so we should create for example here the um, some storefront here we should create the storefront but this is on this is now detail we are talking now not about detail so uh for example we don't have still we don't have the uh floors we can create the floors uh, by hand i mean the by sketch uh, you can do it already uh, because we are no we are know the boundary of the our side or we can use the steel this our uh, mess to create uh, our our floors so how to do that go to the messing site but before we will use the messing site let's go to the east and we'll check okay the my second uh, level starting at uh, uh, four meter point this is all right i will leave on this point this is okay let's go back to 3d and now i will choose the my messing and as you can see we have here at the bottom uh, mass floor let's use the mass floor and now Revit asking us uh, uh, do we want to create the floors on the level 1 and level 2 I will say yes created and as you can see now inside our mm, project we have the something like the floors actually it is the floors let's go to the messing inside and we will uh, choose the floors floors by face and now you can see it's activated we can now create the sun floors let's use the for example uh i don't know like 2000 200 millimeters so it will be enough and create the floors if now i will uh, switch off my mess we will get our floors so the first floor is okay we will leave as it is because uh it's no matter about it uh, but the second floor, it's starting not at this point, it's starting a bit deeper. So let's go to the second floor and let's choose the our floor. Uh, now the boundary and as we know, the as you know, the my um, floor will start, for example, somewhere in the middle. So let's find the middle. Where is the my middle here? It's tr <laughs> It's really hard to find it, but I will try. I hope it's somewhere here. So uh, it will be somewhere here, something like this, or we can use the offset for that one. Let's use the offset and 1700 and let's copy it. Uh, let's say it will be here, it will be here and here. So here it's not enough. Let's make one more. Now it's okay. I will use the trim and let's trim it. Here it's also not enough. Let's make here not uh, like 2500. It will be okay. Yeah, this is what I want. Uh, let's use the trim. Not for that one, for this part. Okay, this will be awesome. And this one I will delete, delete. And here I will create like, uh, mm, let's use again offset two times like this and now i will connect this part this part between this part and this part and that line i will delete don't forget your lines should be uh close 
your sketch lines should be closed. If you not will close your uh, sketch line, you cannot accept the result. Uh, this is rules by Revit. So uh, let's say OK. And we have now second floor. Let's go to Treaty to check it. So this is my second floor. As you can see, it's a bit smaller. Uh, if you will switch on the mess, you can see why it's smaller. Because here will be like open, uh, like double story uh, room. Let's switch off. So this is, will be my uh, floor when I will finish. And the first level we will leave as it is because uh, it's working uh, also like a uh, like a, the pad for the uh, this house. Uh, so uh, you now know the all the things. That part you can finish uh, by yourself. So this is uh, pretty same uh, as we did before, as we did in this part. Uh, just finish uh, this side and uh, put some rooms uh, as you want. And the next tutorial, we will uh, prepare some uh, deeper details and we will transfer it to the uh, Lumen and we will work at Lumen at the next tutorial. Thank you guys for watching. See you next time. And that's it from today, thank you guys for watching, don't forget to subscribe my social media, leave some comments for this video and give some like and see you next time. To support my channel you can go to Gumroad, check that my store, there you can find bottle of this dynamo script or you can buy two story complete house or even the two story residential classic house. By this way you supporting my channel and you making me happy to creating the new videos for you guys. If you still want support my channel but you don't have enough money you can go to the Patreon and only for the one dollar you can support my channel too. You will make me happy too and you can pay seven dollars and you can get all the bottles for every month what I'm posted there.